bio of my dad, which is a good thing since time is limited. He's always asked to provide personal insight describing why I think he deserves this award. Uh, I've known Andy a long time. I have a lot of stories to tell, but uh, I'm not going to do that either. Uh, but it's easy to, for me to answer why I think he deserves this award. This organization was established to recognize individuals who have made a valuable and lasting contribution to our multicultural city and region and to inspire a new generation of leaders. I'm glad that my dad is receiving this award because he's done that and more. From the time he came here as an international student from a country thousands of miles away, not knowing the language very well, until today when he's received more proclamations, citations, and recognitions than I can count for helping people, he's demonstrated again and again his commitment to helping others and improving our society. The professionalism he's shown has enhanced the reputation of the Lebanese community in everyone's eyes. He's well respected for his fairness and impartiality as was his father before him. And it was from his example I learned fairness, love of our heritage, civic mindedness, love of God, love of family, and love of our great country. He's a Renaissance man and a peacemaker and has been a great service not just to the Lebanese community but to our entire community. You know I like statistics, Dad, I realize you've been in our country for 25% of its history. One, one quarter of the United States we've had you here and we're all better off for it. I'm proud to be your son, and I thank the Cleveland International Hall of Fame for recognizing him this evening. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Abdullah Munah. <laughs> 